In a recent statement, uh, Congressman Tom Emmer, a uh, prominent figure in the GOP and a uh, staunch advocate uh, for crypto, expressed his concerns regarding uh, the uh, actions of securities and extreme political breaks uh, in uh, and they're accused Densler of abusing his authority, leading to the expansion of the administrative state while disregarding the interests of the American people. Uh, to address these concerns, uh, Amber plans to sponsor an appropriations amendment aimed at restricting uh, the SEC's use of funds uh, for crypto enforcement until clear rules and regulations are established. Uh, and Ram's criticism of Chair Gensler centers on what he perceives as the weaponization of taxpayer dollars, and that argues that Gensler has utilized his position to further centralize regulatory control without ensuring a transparent and regulatory friendly environment for the crypto industry. Um, by proposing to restrict the SEC's funds for digital asset enforcement, um, Emmer seeks to emphasize the need for clear guidelines that protect both investors and innovators in uh, the crypto space. Uh, addressing Senator Elizabeth Warren's stance on cryptocurrencies, Emma refers to her as a control freak senator with an inclination towards centralized control. Uh, he suggests that Warren favors a government owned banking system uh, and desires to retain a centralized power that comes with central banking. Uh, Emma acknowledges the importance of central banking's role. Uh, you can variations, but uh, emphasizes the need uh, for its evolution to. Uh, adapt to the 21st. And there are further asserts that attempts to suppress digital assets and cryptocurrencies are futile. He cites China's unsuccessful ban on mining activities as evidence that even authoritarian regimes struggled to control decentralized technologies. Emmer believes that the country like the United States, which uh, cherishes freedom, cannot impede uh, the progress of digital assets uh, and cryptocurrencies. The congressman's remarks shed light on his perspective as an advocate for the crypto industry and his concerns are barring regulatory overreach. Emmer emphasizes the necessity of clear and balanced regulations to foster innovation while protecting investors. Uh, by sponsoring an appropriations amendment, uh, he aims to use the legislative process uh, to ensure that uh, the SEC's uh, enforcement actions align with uh, well-defined rules and regulations uh, as Emmer's proposed amendment gains attention and reflects the ongoing debate surrounding crypto regulations in the United States. The crypto industry seeks regulatory clarity to foster growth and innovation while regulatory bodies like the SEC aim to protect investors and maintain market integrity. Finding the right balance between oversight and innovation remains a key challenge. And Emmer's efforts contribute to shaping the future of crypto regulation in the United States. And it remains to be seen how Emmer's appropriations amendment will progress through the legislative process and how uh, it, it, if it will be received uh, by his colleagues. Uh, as the nascent industry continues to evolve, the role of Congress uh, and regulatory agencies in establishing a clear and balanced regulatory framework will be crucial for its long-term success and widespread adoption.